Hey there and welcome to 30 Minute Valheim with Cody. I'm Cody. This is episode 2. Season 2, chapter 2. 222. Two, two. We've defeated Ichthyr. Could be Ichthyr. 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 I don't know. I'm not Norse. I'm just pretend to be one on a game on the YouTubes. But we've got copper. We've got tin. We are ready to take a nap and build a charcoal can. I, in that order. Uh, no. In the other order. So while we sleep, we can produce charcoal. We got four, five charcoal. But we're going to need a lot more charcoal to refine all this stuff. We need 20 stone. I might as well grab wood. We're going to do 25 at a time. Just going to set that up where the hell ever else we can for now in our base area. Without disturbing the bees is the only thing. Okay, this looks like a good enough place to me for a sale. Just kidding. For a charcoal can. Okay. Well, I guess I'll let the land detector thingy decide for me. All right. Exactly what I was saying about my base here. It's just not the best spot right now. We'll see. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> All right. This is dump the charcoal down the hill. Okay. I think the day is ending. So many bees, I don't even want to harvest all the honey. So yeah, the coal's going to be sliding down the hill. It could be a pile somewhere. And uh, they're going to kind of check in on my piggies here. What state did I leave them in? This one doesn't need to be around anymore. Oh, I'm not in kill mode. Guess I had to get to make a butcher's knife soon. You and the one that's running around the yard willy-nilly. You can both serve your purpose in life. Be my hide and meat for a beautiful tomorrow. And, uh, I believe there was a couple extra in here. Yes, there are. There's a few extra in here. Almost got my jet set star. Oh, a happy knife boy here. And you need a name. I believe the first one I killed was Death Star. Shoot, I can't even remember now. Star Jones. There's Death Star. Ringo Star, Mazzy Star. Star Jones. I don't really remember the first name I gave. It's probably somewhere in the video. Yeah, I have two Death Stars though. So we're just gonna go with Kenneth Star. That's the prosecutor. Four. Historic trial, Bill Clinton. I think I got that right. I don't know, really. Charcoal, charcoal, charcoal. Like a freight train. I need about 50 charcoal at least for 
what I've mined so far. So I'm just going to go ahead and keep the charcoal train going here. Yeah, two per one per load. Gotta make that tin and that copper. So once that load is over, we'll keep going. Upgrade stuff. And uh and if the goal is to make Kirtland cores. I mean portals. But I'm also going to need more Sirtland cores and more gray, gray dwarf eyes. Several to be exact. Uh, uh, 17 if I want to make both directions. And yeah, I'm running out of space. Another consideration. Since I can't use that yet, we'll call that a trophy for now, but be able to use it when I get the tin. So yeah. Certain core and gray dwarf eyes. That is my current goal. I'm going to go back to where I remember seeing another burial chamber that I haven't cleared yet. Mark this one off. All right, past that one. There's also a troll cave where I believe at this stage in the game I can find the most gold. Um, but I'm not certain if I can block those trolls yet and be in the cave like that with it. Might need a buckler first before I go to the troll caves. Otherwise, it's kind of pick and hit with bow and arrow, and that just, that's a grind. But it would be a good test of the bronze buckler once I do get it. To see if I can block would be going to the troll cave, because I can always get the heck out of a troll cave. Without worrying about much more add-ons and other challenges I would have if I'm out in the open. So, great dwarf eyes and... Certling cores. That's what we need. I can certainly find those in a burial chamber. Nice little progress here. So yeah, one of the things I want to do for sure is get, start getting a network of portals going. And the easiest way to do that is to clear out some of these burial chambers. Get your attention yet? Yes, I see copper. All right, might as well take out these dudes. Wait, are they coming for me? No. Oh, I don't want to fight that one yet. Let them fight one another. Yes, I will collect some thistle and some blueberries whenever I do see them. Hello. Cool. That tower off to the distance looks like a perfect place to get some gray dwarf eyes. Okay, enough is enough, people. Probably should eat that deer before I go in. I gotta wait about a minute on that. 
If I want stamina, yellow mushrooms are going to be much better than the blueberries. I need to start getting that habit. Of course. I have plenty back home. I also have more meat. But I'm not back home right now. I ran over here with just stamina. Kind of foolishly. What do you think about it? If I had a buke parry on me, I'd use that to just go ahead and speed this process up. I do not. Okay, let's just go by these gray dwarfs while we're wearing this stuff off then. All right. Come on, buddy. Don't need to get you all over here, just one at a time. Or two at a time. Nice hit. Nice, okay. Cool, cool. Okay, yeah, so that's already worn out, but here they come, here they come, they're on me. Let's just deal with this. There you go. Not so bad. Might be a couple more in here. Might be a big one in here. And sometimes they are well inhabited. Is this one already found? Yes, it is, because it's in the same area. I didn't notice at first, but if you smash these, sometimes you get all sorts of cool things. Sometimes blueberries. Look, I got some flint and a little soft wood from that. Alright. Now, the thing is, I. Did now fill up my bags. Cause I <laughs> of course I brought the pickaxes with me. Um There's a couple of decisions to make. I'm not gonna need the rocks for a while. Don't need the thistles just yet. Um I'm just thinking of things I can totally leave behind here. Uh, not even take back to my other base that I don't really need. Yeah, I like this will supply and wood bow supply so I can go back in there and start taking care of business. Okay, there we go. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. A little bit better health there, huh? Faster if I had comfort, but this is what I got. Oh, okay. Nice. Bump, bump. Oh, shit. <sighs> Better be careful. One star there. Definitely going to be more defensive than in a hurry. Not like I'm playing survival mode in the sense of starting over if I die, but I am chilling, that's for sure. I haven't died yet, I'll die when I die. Most likely falling off a cliff in a battle. Or getting ambushed by wolves. These are easy ways to die. Swamp, two star dragger, look out. Getting caught at night by a wraith. These are ways I often die. Okay. Yep. Okay. Thinning out the herd, resting, coming back for more. <laughs> I could do better if I tried, I suppose. I am trying, though. Mic adjustment noises.
I mean, I could gather a couple of stone. So at least when I get through this first layer, I can do something about it. I left the stone in that box, I remembered now. But here, this will do. Or will it? I'm just chopping away at something that's not breaking. Okay. Let's go get those stones, because I've only got five minutes arrested. I'm going to be here late, it looks like. So, as soon as I kill this first volley, I'm going to set up a camp to rest. Alright, before I go in... Oh, or not. Yeah. Before I go in, I need to check my time again. I am at 16. I'm setting the timer. <laughs> okay. All right. See what we can do. There we go. Good not grow the whole world this time. Here he is. Alright. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. Okay, took care of my first issue. Coming in the cave. Go ahead and do this. Alright. Get cozy for a moment. Before I clear out the rest of this cave. Phew! Alright. Well, that was kind of close, actually. I just definitely have died in this situation before. But most of the runs I've done most recently. I uh, just be a little bit more careful. I'm only going to get caught off guard by the really strong ones. The ghost all at the same time. Usually okay. Uh, pull the little archer over here. There we go. narrow passages, it's often the case that you're fighting the wall instead of the thing you really want to fight. Yeah, see, look at that. All this stuff I gotta put in my bags. I'm gonna leave a rock. Good gravy. Winding road to a mushroom. That's how it is in these crypts. Bad pile. Oh yo. Cool. That's what we're looking for. Yes, we already got these map locations. Yes, yes, yes. Three core. Very good, very good. Yeah, if I ever want those rocks, I'll know where I can come get them. Okay, so many friends. Okay. Just need to block them. I just sometimes I just don't. Get too eager. Pretty good, pretty good. We're coring up. Alright, I mean one good advantage of that rock, it'll remind me where I've been. Come on. Work on your strategy, my friend. You need to 
block them early. side clear. Yeah, what's missing is a pearl. Probably take up a little bit more of my space. Or any skeleton trophies. I might just leave some of the wood behind. I got plenty of wood. I have gray dwarf eyes. It looks like that's going to still be something I'm going to need. Okay, one more side. Yep, that's it. Well, four Sertling core. Not enough to have both my kiln types going at the same time <clears throat> but enough to make two portals so gray dwarf eyes though I'm still lacking the sun's going down I believe yeah right yeah so let's head back at least to the edge here or are the way back and then come back and get some gray dwarf eyes if I don't get them on the way out. Looks like I might get them on the way out. Okay, take out the mage. They're in a fight with these guys. Alright, mage is out. Gonna drop stuff I can't pick up, which is exactly butte parries. Which is fine. I'll usually have a surplus of those, not a lack. Leave some stones around, no problem. Yeah, no eyes. All right. Just a few eyes. Gonna need a lot more if I want to make portals. Alright, but like I say, it's getting dark, so I'm going to head back. I've gotten part of my goal accomplished. We'll need to find, I believe, another burial ground to really satiate my thirst for certain cores. Maybe I'll find some. I found the other coal. Right, go ahead and pop this thing so I can get a little faster. Without wearing myself out so fast. And just go, baby, go. So I don't want to be too far from home in case a raid occurs. From either Skeleton now or the Forest Awakens. Because I've defeated Eek there and I think that will be what's coming at me soon. Brutes and all manner of dwarfs chipping away at my fences. Uh, might even want to be able to have a post where I can defend those borders if that does start to happen. Really don't need much, just a little bit of a tower right in the middle there, because I don't have much. Taking quite a bit to get all the way in here to my boar, <clears throat> even the biggest brutes. All right, so yes, what exactly is going on in my satchels? So yes, this is exactly enough for one portal, but I need to be able to go both directions. Yeah, 
yes, we're definitely going to be filling up. Like I say, we're I've kind of done outgrown this whole area, but I'm still here. Ooh, but I am about to need to start building a little bit more space for myself before this becomes maddening. Now I can always do another row here, which will be fine. On foxes, and I think I guess that's the next move. Let's consider that the current move. That'll definitely buy me some space. So let's go ahead and do that. Look at that. We're full just about in every box. Don't need to be carrying those on a mount on a mining expedition. But one will do in case I have a strong desire to get rid of some rocks. I'm going to go ahead and go to sleep now. Just because they may have amped it up a little bit. Right, now that you killed the boss, we're going to send worse things at night to you. Uh, metal's in my mouth. Well, yum, 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 yum. Okay. So, same idea as before gonna put this close to this as I can there we go there's where it was there we go oh yeah and this one's a little bit not as but that's good I've still got plenty of room okay how much of this sign am I gonna be covering up here Redo the signs. Memory test. Now, often coal and stuff pounces out, and I got plenty of coal here and rolling all the way down the hill. <laughs> okay. Before I dump my wood in there, I want to use it for the signs. Dump the wood in and take another nap. and soft hides in food trophies and gear the useless trophies thing. Food I can't do anything about yet. Well, yeah, for now actually considered an ingredient. Put the hides on their own rack for now. Meats on their own rack. getting way too much meat. That boar farm paid off a little quicker than I thought. Okay, look at that. That's pretty good. Got a cooked meat here, yes, but it's fine. It's fine. And hides. Okay. That's better there. that wood to make some coal keep that in my property now this is really more of a food stuff it's gonna be in a bucket I'll call potions later looks good I guess but what I'd also do is I make a bucket outside for my coal and things I'll do that later as well
now, let's do this. Makes sense to my mind. These are the manufacturing products. All right, and then, so like I said, this is more of a food in a way, but sort of a, the hide of nature. All right. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and put a bucket here. Well, I got it inside. Uh, never mind that idea. I'm going to keep the wood that I've got for now to make more coal. Keep that wood as spare. Perhaps. We'll see. Okay. Um, and <laughs> I picked up another flower while I'm out there. I believe it's finally time to go, go to sleep. Wait, I can't sleep this time. Well, what exact time is it? Did I just skip an entire day? I don't know, but I'm over 30 minutes, so good night.